to my channel it's your girl ayana renee all right so today's video we're doing a mukbang i'm super hungry i just dropped in off of his cousins so we're gonna do a chinese food slash sushi mukbang answer some questions these are some questions i've had in my messages some of them and some of them when i went on instagram when i shouldn't have been i seen a couple of dms so I'm gonna answer some questions that y'all may want to know. So first things first, I have, um, I just went to my local grocery store. I got this one, this is the raw salmon and avocado roll, just basic. Then I got this insanity roll, this is raw too. I thought I got a cooked one, but I didn't. Then I went, I got me an order of crab ragoons and um, some, What's this called? Some um, spring rolls, two, just one order. And then I'm also gonna be making everything. This is gonna be there too. This is the chicken, this is the um, Korean black bean sauce chicken ramen. It's really good, it's really spicy, but it's good. I'm gonna have that with it. And also I'm gonna have to drink um, some Arizona green tea. I got some chopsticks from off of Amazon. It was in this pack of 10, super affordable. And they're washable, wash, dishwashers. Aren't they pretty? I think I'm gonna use these red ones today. I use the uh, greenish ones. And it, there's instructions on the back in English that you can follow. I'm gonna cook these noodles first. Then I'm gonna plate everything, get prepared, then we'll, we'll get into the questions. Okay y'all, so everything is done. I have the crab ragoons, the Pittsburgh roll, the salmon avocado roll. This is the sauce that goes with this. The two um, spring rolls and the spicy black bean noodles. But it'll do, it's just, a, um, what's the call? It's just up. Stays. Okay, and my drink. So I'll first go ahead and pour my drink into my cup. Hope y'all doing okay. I'm super tired, so I hope my energy is not too low. Okay. I remember most of the questions, and I wrote some of them down over here. So first question, so like I said, um, some of these questions are questions I didn't get to from before. And then I seen I had some messages in my IG when I was supposed to be on it. So I'm answering them now. These noodles are so good, but they are spicy, but they're good. A, a few bites because I'm like extremely hungry. He fucking that shit up. <laughs> Okay. So, first question says, Are you single? Yes. I am. I feel like right now, in the season that I'm in, it's best for me to be single right now. Um, I 
until what I desire is brought to my attention. Like. So, also until I'm able to be accepting of it the way I need to be accepting of it. I think it's best if I stay single right now. Um, if it does get hard, I think that was another reason why I didn't get off social media. Because... Definitely have me seeing all the people in love and stuff. But it's a hard pill to swallow when, you know, that's not your reality. Not even close. So, single. Not ready to mingle right now, but. What, man, being taken on dates? You know? You know what I'm saying? Take me out the day. <laughs> but very single. Question. How's my mental health? It's doing good. Um, I feel like this is a season for me to practice being alone. If I've been secluding myself a bit to focus and to get my ducks in a row. And to have a lot of self-evolving that I really need to add. like you ever be like wow like you ever sit around somebody or you be the person and you talk about all the stuff you're going to do like all these plans right and you don't do none of them it gets annoying like not even just to hear the person say it but to be the person saying it a lot of time so putting forth action keeping the promise to myself you know I think that's important I wish I had some kimchi but I don't I don't want all this ginger. Mentals have been good. Just keeping to myself. This new year was different. Did not go out drinking. That's the first. So. I think that's how I knew. For myself, I needed to be more intentional this this year. Not even for anyone, but for myself because I just haven't been. So my mental health is doing good. Um, I'm probably gonna have to get another therapist, but it's been good. Speaking more positive. Trying to take it one step at a time, giving myself more grace, understanding knows a complete sentence, and that's just what it is. Next question: How is it being a baby? How is it being a single mother? I'm a child. I'm not easy. Especially long distance. Um, it's, it's challenging. But I wouldn't trade my son in for the world. So. Great for him. For the child that I have. I love my son. Um, 
I'm glad I'm a mother, single mother of one. <laughs> Let's just say that. Because two, three, four, five, you know what I'm saying? Kids alone. Shout out to the real, the real strong moms out there. Okay. I like that strength. And Aiden's for his cousin right now. Cousins. Mm -mm -mm. Um, love being a mom is a hard yes, especially we're trying to date, we're trying to get to know people, we're trying to make time, we're trying not to be tired, we're trying to make time for myself. It's challenging. Um, dealing with my child's other parent, uh, it's, it's been easier. For advice I would give you have children with that's rule number one. Two, try to get try to have the good good communication the best you can. I know it's not always easy because sometimes people just like to disagree with you just to have something to do. But try your best on your end to be able to be cordial. Obviously have boundaries. You know. Get your get your point across also but just try to sometimes be the bigger person and get the um the situation resolved too so sometimes it ain't worth earning one month ago sorry excuse me it ain't worth back going back and forth with them it is nice sometimes so, keep them on um, next one. Goals for 2022. Y'all. Yeah. I just got a gym membership the other day. Yeah, I mean, honestly, I know. But I didn't eat nothing all day. And I went to work. So, I'm hungry. Like, I'm starving. Um, and it's early. It's like, um, it's only 6.31, so I'll probably do a workout before bed. Like 15, 20 minutes. Take a shower. Go to sleep, because I gotta go back to work. Um, so goals. Get my health together. Um, get my health together. Level myself more. Y'all, how I'm about to be loving on myself is about to be probably like semi like crazy low key because I don't mean sexually, like I'm gonna like loving me, like mm, girl, it hit different. I really asked for that as we went into the new year. I scripted, I journaled. It's like, hey, I just wanna, I just wanna love myself. I just wanna love on myself. I just wanna love me some me. I, any shape, any shape, any hairstyle, any blemish, any no blemish. With double chin, no double chin, you know what I'm saying? In a relationship, without a relationship. Big friend group, no friend group. I think that's it was very important for me to take this time to <clears throat> do that for me. Like going going into the age of twenty seven this year, I, I think I'm a love. I think I'm loving who I'm becoming. So I just want to praise her. You know, the good days and the bad days. Just praise self as much as I can. Date myself. Now I don't necessarily eat. I just go out and eat. I mean, like, catch a movie. Go dancing. Even if you're by myself, do something. Like, I just need to do it more. I'll stop having excuses, you know? So, like I said, loving on me more. Uh, spending time with myself more. Uh, wearing what I want to wear. Stop being scared because of size or what. 
people may think of all that shit. Create. Because I love creating. You know? Find things that bring me joy. Be, try to be, be the best mother I know I can be to my son. Get prepared for his butt going to school. I guess. His school going to be a thing in September. Because he'll be six. That's another thing. Like, so yeah, I'm hungry. So, for um, I didn't see this question. In regards to dating, do you feel like you want to get to know somebody online or in person? Yeah. Try to go on a dating site. Main account. I won't say what dating site it is though. Main account. Cancel the account in two minutes. Mm -mm. Wait. I feel like. I don't want to say, oh, I feel like I'm not good enough to date anybody until I level up, but I feel like I want to elevate myself within my self worth first so I have things I'm proud of that I've accomplished a little bit more then put myself out there with dating i don't want to come to somebody like healing i'm doing that i'm getting a the the um the handle on that part but like i'm going to be able to drop places make you all blah 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 yeah have the means to do that financially as well things of that sort like i'm going to be prepared you know what I'm saying? Like, so, I'm trying to get myself together in that aspect. But, I mean, I'd be cool with meeting somebody face-to-face. -face. It'd be easier. <clears throat> so, you can't say, oh, you, I didn't know you. Look, look. I don't camouflage my back. I don't say I'm what I ain't. Like, you know? I'm cool with meeting somebody face-to-face. -face. It probably will be face-to-face, -face, car. No, I don't think I'm part of the app no more. I think I was for the apps when I was younger, like to hook up. But that's it. Fine. Not even just set boundaries. But I'm learning that what you desire, there's nothing wrong with it. So if, if you're talking to a person or if you're dealing with a person and they're not fulfilling you or, you know, it's, it's seeming like it's forced or it seems like it's not coming off naturally for that person. I keep talking to them. I keep dealing with them. You can be holding each other back from your people, your person, and their person. So just keep that in mind, you know? So I hope y'all enjoyed this um very um very um brief very brief uh q a hope you enjoyed this video don't forget to like share comment subscribe if you guys want me to do another video like this <clears throat> or if you have any more questions just comment them down below or message me on instagram all right guys thank you so much and i hope you guys have a good night